Hey guys, if you're shopping for knives and gear, make sure you check out the description of the video you're watching right now for links to some great online retailers. There's also individual links for knives that I personally recommend. Thanks. What's going on YouTube? Metal Complex here and today I've got another short little unboxing to share with you guys. I don't know what's in here but that's kind of the way that I like it. Uh, this was likely in uh, response to my recent community post about new knives that I was looking for for review. So thank you so much to the person who sent this along. We'll find out here in a sec. Thanks so much to my generous patrons who are supporting me right now. If you're enjoying the daily knife content on this channel and you'd also like to support me and get your hands on some cool stickers and other benefits, there's of course a link for my Patreon right down in the description. And please follow me on Instagram at metal underscore complex. All right, let's go ahead and get into it here. People that keep asking me about my scalpel. I forget if I don't explain this thing, you know, it's, it causes confusion. This was actually made by Kiefer and was selected by my viewers as the dedicated unboxing tool. There's a series called Quest for the Perfect Unboxing Knife um, that you can find on my in my um, uh, uh, my playlist sec uh, section of the the channel. Stuttered around that horribly. I have not had enough coffee this morning. All right, we have a Pro Tech. We have a note. Hang on. Yeah, we do have a note. This was sent by Troy. Hang on one sec, guys. Let me take a look at Troy's note. All right. Uh, oh, he does have an Instagram. Hang on here. Hang on. Oh, and he says Merry Christmas to you and your family. Thank you so much. Instagram. <laughs> Come on. There we go. Uh, underscore Troy Jones Y. Give this man a follow. It's because of people like him that I'm able to bring you guys daily knife content. Very excited. Love ProTech. If you guys don't know... Turn the exposure up a bit. ProTech, in my opinion, makes the best side opening automatic knives in the world. And I asked for a lot of ProTechs um, this, uh, this round. So expect to get uh, quite a bit of ProTech content in the next month or two. What do we have here? Ooh, ooh whoa, whoa, what's, this, what's the name of this one? What's the name of this one? Gosh darn it. Uh, <laughs> the Newports. There we go. The Newports. All right, here we go. Ready? Oh yeah, cool. So this is a nice, straightforward um, little automatic knife. S35VN, which I thought was cool. Love uh, uh, their deep carry clip. Looks huge on this thing, but I mean, here's the cool thing. You can actually get a full grip on this guy. I like the simple profile. Um, Protect does a good job, generally speaking. By the way, this will definitely be linked down below. I specifically asked for a bunch of Protects that are available because you guys always jump on me when I <laughs> review knives that aren't available. The Protect um, uh, uh, Newport is absolutely available right now in, in a bunch of different colors, but really cool. Nice and thin on the spine, nice and thin behind the edge. S35VN, nice deep carry clip. I mean, this is obviously, I mean, I'm going to give you guys a full review, but I wanted to review this one because it looked like such a straightforward, good little automatic knife with a nice tip. Really, um, you can, uh, I mean, it's, it's a small, lightweight automatic knife that's got a good amount of blade and you can get a full four finger grip on it. I just thought this looked great, right? Really straightforward. Look how simple. No hardware showing on this side, right? Just a couple of screws over here. Very cool. Number 416. As per usual, I think ProTech knives are all numbered. I love that this, these are S35VN. And these tend to be a pretty good price. I don't know what they are, but USA made, automatic, right? Premium materials for, for an auto. We generally see aluminum for automatic knives, which I think is just fine. Um, but uh, yeah, ProTech, if you're looking for a high quality side opening auto, um, definitely check out ProTech. I'll link this knife and ProTech knives in general right down below so you guys can check all that stuff out. Like I always say, this is not a review. This is actually, this is the very first time I've ever handled this knife, just giving my first impressions. Here in a couple of weeks, you'll have a full comprehensive review as per usual. So you guys can, uh, you know, hear my gathered thoughts on it. But this is beautiful. Very, very cool. Thank you very much, Troy, for sending this guy in. That's going to be pretty much it for today, guys. Be sure to follow me on Instagram at metal underscore complex. If you enjoyed this video, please leave a like. If you'd like to check out my other content, I do, of course, have lots of videos of knives that are either expensive or inexpensive that I do or don't like. So check those out. And if you enjoy all my content, go ahead and click on that metal complex logo right there and subscribe because there's definitely more coming. Thanks again for watching, everybody, and have a great day.